Hello and welcome to WordPress Tutorials. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to uh, connect your website or how to sign up to a website using login with Google option uh, for your WordPress website. For example, this is my website topproductsdirect.com and I want my users to be able to log in using uh, Google because um, the registration process might be a uh, little hefty and uh, if anyone wants to uh, if anyone have a Google account then they can easily uh, sign up through uh, Google or Gmail uh, by clicking uh, login with Google just button like this and if you also want to uh, make this login with Facebook button then the link is in the iCard and also uh, you can uh, watch that video for uh, both of these options so uh, for starting let's log in to my dashboard uh, come to your plugins add new in the search bar type super socializer and press enter click on install now for WordPress social share and social login install now activate the plugin after installing this after activating the plugin there will be a menu in your uh, left sidebar super socializer click on that now click on social login in super socializer here uh, you will see a checkbox enable social login click uh, check this box and in the select social networks click on Google you can also click on Facebook but uh, that is completely a different video uh, I'll send you uh, share the link in the iCard okay now we will need the Google client ID and Google client secret and from where you can get it uh, open a new tab and type Google developer console press enter open Google developers console if you already have an application in Google developer console then you will have to click here and click on new project but uh, if you do not have any projects then there will be a create button here so you will have to click on that but this, the rest of the process is the same new project give your project a name uh, I'll give my website name top products direct and click on create now click on OAuth consent screen or click on credentials uh, let's click on OAuth consent screen and give your application name choose external option click on create now choose your app name copy your domain name use HTTP or HTTPS now you have to authorize your domain add a domain its top products direct save and continue Save and next. Choose 
choose the available scopes and click on update save and continue optional info save and continue okay now come to credentials now click on create credentials a auth client id choose application type in my case web application name top products direct now click on authorize redirect uris click on add uri open your website and copy the link please remember do not add any slash after this uri and click on create okay we got our client id and client secret copy client id and paste it in the google client id column and then copy the secret and then paste it in the google client secret section and click on save changes now you will have to uh, add your social login buttons uh, in the places where you want to uh, register your user enable at login page yes checked enable at register page enable at comment form okay these three if you want to add it some other places then you can also choose them uh, click on save changes there are some other settings you can also uh, do them okay now uh, come to your login page and refresh it and we have uh, Google login with Google function here uh, if you want to add Facebook social login then the link is in the iCart uh, please click that so uh, you can also make that uh, please give this video a thumbs up and please subscribe to our channel so you won't miss our future updates thank you